So if you want to do a screen recording using the Camtasia recorder, but edit it in other editing applications such as Premiere Pro, then you have to take in some codec settings. So in order to do that, I'm just going to click on record right here. And then in the record option, I'm just going to go around into tools, into option. So over here, if I were to go around into input, you can see that by default, the recording codec is set to TSC2. So this is perfect if you want to uh, record everything uh, for Camtasia editing purposes. But if you want to record it for uh, other purposes, that is to take it into other applications such as Premiere Pro, then you have to select S.264 right here. So once you select S.264 and press OK, now it has been set to S.264 recording, just like that. So let me just re hit record right here and then see how that works out. I'm going to hit record. There's the countdown right there. Three, two, one. So over here, you can see that I'm in my desktop and this is my PC and I can right click to get more options in it. So just like that, I have my recorder uh, over here. So now I'm just going to stop this out and let's see how that works out. So over here, there is my footage just like this, as you can see, and this has been recorded as Camtasia.trec. So I can simply go over here on to uh, open file location right over here and it'll take me onto the folder where the file is located. So you can see that it is on my D drive where we set the recorder recorded footage to be. So although the extension is TREC, this is an S.264 codec video. So that means I can simply rename this into MP4. If you don't see the extension, you can go over here on the view panel and then you can enable file name extensions. So simply go over here and then change it out into MP4, just like this, and press OK. So just like this, now, since the file is still open, it is not allowing me to change the extension. So let me just close this around, uh, just like this, close this around. And then I'm going to change the name to MP4, just like this. And then now this has been changed into an MP4 footage. So now in applications such as Premiere Pro, you can simply import that out. So I'm just going to go around and then create a quick project right here. And I'm just going to go around and then import out that footage. So I'm just going to go around here, import out the MP4 footage, and that's get, that gets supported over here in Premiere Pro, just like this. So if I were to go over here, this is the footage as you can see. So over here you can see that. And then I can start editing this out in other applications just like this. But one of the disadvantages of this is that uh, you don't have uh, access to the mouse movement because in Camtasia Recorder, the mouse movements are recorded separately. And that is how you can set up the codec to be edited in other applications such as Premiere Pro. So hope you guys learned something as always. And as always, please like, comment, share and subscribe.